Hi, my name is Manish Goral and I'm a cardiologist at HeartSouth Cardiovascular Group. I'm going to be talking about aortic aneurysms. This is an enlarged portion of the aorta, which is the major blood vessel that supplies blood to the body. It can occur at any point along the aorta, but the most common location is below the kidneys, calling it an abdominal aortic aneurysm. The main complication of such an aneurysm is rupture as the aneurysm grows, often leading to death. Once an aneurysm is found, treatment depends on the size of the aorta. Small and medium-sized aneurysms are closely monitored with either an ultrasound or a CT scan. Larger aneurysms, those greater than 5 centimeters or 2 inches, require repair before they rupture. Because many aneurysms often grow slowly and produce few if any symptoms, they are difficult to detect. Smoking, atherosclerosis, which is often called hardening of the arteries, and male sex are the major risk factors for abdominal aortic aneurysms. Guidelines now recommend that men over 60 who have smoked or have a family history should get a screening ultrasound. Women over 65 with a family history should also get a screening ultrasound. Patients with large aneurysms typically need to be repaired. This can now be done through endovascular surgery, which is a less invasive approach. It involves placing two catheters in the femoral artery or groin area and then deploying a stent across the aneurysm to seal it off. If you have risk factors for aortic aneurysms, discuss with your doctor at Cardiovascular Group whether a screening test is appropriate for you.